Speaker, December 10th will mark 68 years since the adoption of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights. This is the benchmark for the fundamental human rights that all people, no matter their race, religion, ethnicity, sex or status, are entitled to. The Universal Declaration was created to help heal divides left by the Second World War, but it's just as important today. World events of 2016 have been poignant reminders of how fleeting and fragile human rights are for billions worldwide. Every day, freedom of religion is threatened, movement is restricted, free speech is stifled, and conflict creates additional turmoil for so many. Human Rights Day is an annual reminder that this terrible reality exists. This year's focus encourages Canadians to stand up for victims of abuse in an increasingly interconnected world. Countries like Canada have a responsibility to renew our commitment to protect those very basic rights, rights that vulnerable people often cannot address themselves. I invite Canadians to reflect on what they can do to raise awareness and how they can participate in protecting and improving human rights. Mr. Speaker, compassion never goes unnoticed or unrewarded. Here, here.